everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm excited to share something with you today. As you can see from the title of this video, it is an unboxing of something very exciting from Rothy's. I have done a Rothy's video recently and it's on a pair of shoes. It's very comfortable, very nice, and I'll link it below if you wanted to see that. I'll also do an updated video as I wear the shoe a little bit longer, but it is I love it. I've gotten tons of compliments. So yeah, if you're interested, definitely watch that video. Um, and if you haven't subscribed, definitely consider subscribing. All right, so we're here today to unbox this and I'm here to show you that this box is humongous. Usually Rothy's come in if you've purchased from them before. It just comes in the shoe box and that's the shipping box. But as you can see, this is way bigger than your average shoe box and it is not a big pair of shoes. So let's just get started. I have my scissor in here. Rothy's has been killing it lately. So um, looks like here's my receipt. Yep. And this is what it looks like. Very well packaged. Don't know if it's in frame, but lots of these little bubble wraps. Okay, just take that. Oh, there's a lot. Okay, don't know if I like that because that's a lot. Oh my god, this is so cute. Look, look how cute. Oh my god, there's. Oh my god, I can't. It's really heavy. But look at that. The boxes are camel colored. Okay. So this is what's on the bottom of that box. As you can see, let me just show you because I've never seen these boxes before. It's in a sort of gray toned camo color and this one's very flat. And then the other one that I grabbed first is more boxy. But as you can see, it's the same gray camo color. So I'm excited. So let's actually open this. Uh, I don't really want to open it. Oh, I just saw that. It has like a not inwards and also has that on this side as well. Um, and then on the front, it has the little Rothy's logo. Okay, I guess we, we have to open it, right? Uh, it has the signature blue ribbon right here. Oh, I like ribbon. Actually, you know, oh, I don't need to do it. Okay, I just saw that it lifted up. Okay, I see. So normally, they would tape using the first one, then you use this to open it, and then you can retape it here to send it back to them. But because I think they mailed it in that big box, they didn't even, uh, they didn't need to do this. So here we are, and this box uh, has a little note that says, sustainable since day one. We proudly crafted this partially from ocean bound plastic collected within 30 miles of coastlines and marine environments. This was, knit with 100% recycled material. So that's an, actually another thing I wanted to point out is that they've always used recycled plastic, so from bottles, plastic bottles, to make their shoes. And recently they've created a new material and that is combining the recycled pl uh, bottles, plastic, to the ones that are found in the ocean or are on the coastline, which will eventually go into the ocean just because of how the waves wash. So that's very good. It saves a lot of plastic from our, or it doesn't save, it like reuses the plastic that we have as waste. And yeah, basically doesn't, uh, they don't create any new waste. So that's, that's a very good thing. So I'm just gonna continue here. So inside is a dust bag and the dust bag has the Rothy symbol right here. The dust bag also has a drawstring right here for you to close it, very nice feels like a very solid piece. If you bought the shoes before, you'll also know it does come with a dust bag. I hardly ever put my shoes in dust bags though, so. Okay, ooh, this is so pretty. Okay, so this is the first piece that I got and it is a, what they call a catch-all. It kind of looks like a cosmetic case or any like case, you know, it feels, feels very much like their shoes. I would even say more like strong and rigid. The zipper is nice, do you see that? <laughs> and then the inside looks like that. It has a uh, canvas lining. It doesn't feel like the same material on the outside. The outside material has that knit that you normally see on the, their shoes and the inside is much uh, finer and it is a different material, I believe. So there is a care booklet here and then on the back you'll see Rothy's written right there. And then yeah, it's just like, a big open 
spot. I guess if I had, let's see, I have my phone here. I, I don't think I would put my phone in here, but just for reference, I have the Pixel 2 and that's what it looks like. So lots of space. This is in the medium size and they also come in the mini and a large size. So uh, the color that I got in particular has like the yellow trim, the, the light gray, the dark gray. It looks really pretty. And here's the back of it with the signature uh, blue Rothy's thing. This color is called Dove Gray. And like I said, it is the medium size. This is awesome. Um, this is washable, which is very nice. All of their shoes are washable. And the, this new material, including the new items, are also washable. So you just need to wash it in cold water and don't dry it, air dry it. So I'm going to put this back in here. All right, let's move on to the second item, which is in this big box. I'm not gonna try to open this because I know it just lifts up. <gasps> Look how pretty. And it says the same note at the top, so I'm not gonna reread that. Oh, let's open it. It is huge. All right, so it's in this dust bag. And then we'll put this box down. Can you guess what this is? It, it is pretty big. It does feel kind soft at the same time it's crazy okay so again the rothy's dust bag i don't know if you can see it one-sided drawstring right here it is huge <laughs> um all right so, here we are it is their essential tote uh so this is the same line that came with all of their stuff, they actually had a bags line. So now not only do they do shoes, they also do bags. And I guess in this case, accessories, uh, as you can see from my catch-all. This one is their tote. It is the biggest item that they have. They also come in a handbag, which they call handbag, but it has a cross body strap, adjustable, removable, which I considered getting as well. But let's talk about the tote. So I've been in a t on a tote kick lately. And so I've decided to get this one for like sort of comparison, right? This bag feels softer. The material feels softer than the catch-all that I just showed you. It feels even softer than their shoes, I want to say. Uh, it, so I, the color that I got has orange, orange-ish, almost red actually, now that I see it. On the, on the website, it kind of looks more orange-ish. It has the same light gray, dark gray, and also on this side, and it has that signature blue uh, Rothy's blue thing right there and then on the bottom you have a bright red orange red sort of what's this material oh this is a uh, the rubber material that's on the bottom of their shoes I believe it feels familiar but yeah that's the feet the bag itself is pretty soft so that it flops so it look for example you see how it just kind of falls flat so it came folded like this and that's probably why it's trying to do that but let me just, sh okay, so the inside has one of these, <laughs> this looks like their shoes actually. It's like a big, big version of their insoles. Yeah, <laughs> but it's for your bag. So I suppose, yeah, if you lay it down, so I, it just fell down on its own. So like that, just lay it down. So that's your base. And so now, oh, there's nothing in it. So I guess it's still doing the same thing. I'll have to play around with it but yeah so that's what it looks like so if you put something heavy in here chances are the bottom will help not you know uh, create that dome if it's something heavy also on the inside you'll see that there is a zipper pocket right here and I'm gonna, oh the zipper is really nice the care card care booklet i didn't share with you what was in the care booklet on the other one oh it's not a care booklet it just says there's so much to love Learn about the superb craftsmanship, sustainable materials, and special care for your Rothy's bag. So it just says that. Um, I don't think we need this. Uh, okay, so what else is in here? There is also in this little baggie right here. Ah, okay, so this is the wash bag. So if, I, if you could see, it's actually kind of see-through. And it has a zipper right here. And inside is just one big mesh bag. And the idea is when you wash your bag, you wanna, I guess, keep it from getting snagged or 
broken. So the whole bag fits in here. It is a pretty big mesh bag. And yeah, it's like, it's like a little laundry bag <laughs> for your bag so you can wash it. So this bag is washable in cold water and it, you just don't dry it. So yeah, don't dry it. Otherwise, I don't know what happens actually, but don't dry it. There's also a zipper closure, as you can see right here. Just gonna close it really quickly. It's, does it feel smooth? It's smooth, okay. The other one felt smoother, but... <laughs> uh, right, and so that's the inside. There's also two little little nub right here. I believe this is for a magnet. So they also have a wristlet that has a magnet too. So you can attach the wristlet by magnets onto the side of your bag. But I didn't get that one just because I didn't think I needed it, but I can always add it later. And they also come in a lot of different colors, including this dove gray. They also have the tote in that. So if you wanted a set, you can also get it in that. I'll try to insert some photos uh, so that you can get an idea. So let me tell you the prices. This medium sized catch all is $95. And if you get the mini one, it is 65. And if you get the larger one above this one, it is I think 125. So the, this tote is $275. I believe uh, they only have one size right now and they also have the handbag and I think that's a little bit more. I don't know on the top of my head, but I'll link it all below if you're interested. They, they still cost a bit of money, like if you think of fabric, but this is very durable fabric. I had their shoes and there's no wear and tear. You can wash it so you could use these bags for a long, long time and these are good for the environment. So not only can you reuse this bag multiple times, even when it gets dirty. You can always, you can also help lower the carbon footprint. So that's a very good thing, I think. I don't know how well this will hold or how well this will work with my lifestyle, just because I've never used anything that is a bag for Rothy's. So I'm excited to give this a try. I did bring my other tote right now. So I have this, this one is a Sen Rev Voya tote. And right now, let me just show you in comparison. They're very similar in size. Um, as you can see, I would, I would say they're actually very similar in size. I have my laptop in here. So let me just bring this out. So the Senrev has a slip compartment which can fit my MacBook, 13, MacBook Air 13. Uh, so I'm just gonna toss this in here. Oh my gosh, there's like tons of room. Look at that, you could fit a 15 inch, no problem in here. Yep. And then, so if I just held it up, that's, it has my laptop in it. And you, you don't see the doming at the bottom because there is the base put in. Although, although your laptop generally <laughs> will try to fall down just because there's no slip compartment to hold it in place. So that's something that I'd have to look at, maybe get an organizer for this bag. But this is, like I said, very nice because like you can fold it up, you can use it as your shopping tote, you can use it as a travel bag. I probably see myself using it most as a travel bag just because you could fold it up so you could put it in your luggage. You, there, it fits a ton and you can wash it so if it gets dirty on your trip, no problem. You just throw this in the wash when you get home. I don't know if I'm gonna use it as a work bag just because right now I can see it being very flimsy. So unless I find an organizer that will help keep its shape. Uh, I don't know if I will be able to put my laptop in it without it just falling all over the place. The weight of this is two and a half pounds. So it is actually kind of heavy, this like just holding it. And I know a lot of people have asked if my bags are heavy and I would say this one is actually on the heavier side. I. I don't think it's the heaviest bag that I have, but for what it's made of, I act was actually surprised when I pulled it out of the box. It was actually quite heavy for being a fabric material. So I'm not quite sure why yet, uh, just because I don't see a lot of hardware. I'm assuming it's because the, the fabric is quite thick. Like if I held it, it feels like a thick fabric. So maybe that's why, but yeah, I don't know. I'll, I'll, I'll put some stuff in it, I'll play around with it, and then I'll give you guys an sort of updated review later. So if you're interested, uh, let me know in the comments below. If you have any questions, let me know so that when I do the updated video, I'll be able to cover that. 
I do want to say that I have a $20 off of your first purchase. Um, I'll link it below. I'm not affiliated. Uh, I'm not sponsored. This video is not sponsored. I just really like Rothy's and I like the message and the idea behind their company, which is to recycle the plastic that we have created in the world and to not create new plastic. So I'm very on board with that. And the fact that you can rewash a lot of the shoes and now bags, that's also very attractive to me. So that's why I'm just sharing with you. So if you are interested in saving $20, definitely check the link below. For today's video i hope you enjoyed it and had a lot of fun seeing the new items from rothy's if you do have any questions like i said leave them in the comments below and i'll try to answer it um, if not this time in my next updated video if you would like to see this on me uh, i'll be posting pictures on my instagram at clutch to carry all very soon i'll see you guys in my next video bye